everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a haul video for you and it's always exciting doing a haul. The items that I'm going to show you, I've been kind of collecting over the past week or so, getting ready for summer and all of that. And I was just feeling quite spendy, I think. So let's start off with a new look. I bought two items. The first item that I picked up were these patterned shorts which have a tie waist <laughs> which hasn't been tied. Kind of like a tile material if you can call it that with a nice floral pattern on the bottom and the colours in this are blues and blacks and pinks which I think is quite nice because it means that you can pair it up with any other similar colours. Those shorts were I think $14.99 which was really good for a pair of shorts. To go with those shorts I bought some sandals. They are these little heel sandals which have a kind of crisscross band across the toe area and they are wide fit which is perfect for me. <laughs> they're really comfortable despite having a heel I think because they're not flat on the ground, you don't feel as though you are walking barefoot. And these were £17.99, which I thought for a pair of heel sandals is pretty good. Then I went on to spend a bit of money in Topshop, of course, because they always have such nice stuff in it's summer. It's so tempting to buy all. I didn't buy all of it, don't worry. So the first item in Topshop was this cami top that I spotted and liked. I went for this colour because I just think it's stunning salmony pink slash coral and it's got like a V neck and a v, v back as well and oh I love the hanger. This was £16 which I thought for Topshop was actually really good and they've got so many different colours in there at the moment. I thought it would go quite nicely with the shorts I got from New Look because of the pink in the top and pink in the shorts. So I thought that was a nice little outfit. Then I saw this amazing skirt in the tall section of Topshop. I don't know whether you can see the detail but it's a white A-line skirt with this floral overlay and it is so pretty. It's simple but it's so intricate as well. It's got um, an underlay skirt which is quite a thick material which is good so you don't have any VPL or forbid. The only thing that put me off was that it was £38 which is quite pricey and there's the zip up the side which I think is quite nice. It's not like right in the middle or anything like that to distract from the beautiful detail. Finally from Topshop I bought this ribbed crop top again from the tool section. I spotted this just as I was picking up the skirt. It's a lovely raspberry pink colour. It's just really comfortable, really stretchy material. I think this was only like £8 which is really good so I thought no, I might as well pick that up. <laughs> So I did. And that is all I got from Topshop. The other day I went to Blue Water Shopping Centre, which is on the way to Essex, I think, for me, near the Dartford crossing. And I picked up a couple of things from Forever 21, which I don't have here at home. So whenever I go there, it's like I need to stock up on all the nice stuff. First thing I picked up were these tropical palm tree print shorts which were just kind of casual shorts which I thought were quite fun. The palm trees are in navy blue colour with a bit of black in there as well and on a white background. They've got a stretchy back as well so they're quite comfortable to wear and they were only £10 which I thought was very affordable for a pair of shorts. And the next item I bought was a white top because I kind of needed one just to wear under kimonos and patterned trousers and things like that. We've got this lovely white top which has a kind of scalloped edge and has this cutout, laser cutout detail. It's kind of floral patterned and it's, I thought that was really pretty for a basic style top and it's got this lovely back as well which creates a bit of interest. 
thought it would go really nicely with a few items that I own. This was really cheap, it was £12, which is really affordable, and I just think that that's a really good value for a top like that. And uh, the final item that I got from Forever 21 were these black crisscross sandals, which are kind of leather look and they just looked quite stylish. These were £10, so again, really cheap. I kind of like the simple style of these shoes, but they're still quite sophisticated at the same time. And again, I thought these would be great for holiday, and if they do break or whatever, it's £10. I think there was a nude, there was a tan colour, and there was a nude, nudie pink, which was a suede material, I think something like that so you can check out their website if you're interested in those I'll try and link what is still available in the description box below so if you are interested in anything then you can check that out the final place that I bought something from from Blue Water was Urban Outfitters I don't often shop there I do find it is very overpriced most of the time but I just thought I'd go in and have a look there was a couple of nice things actually but not a lot that I actually needed. And this item isn't actually summer related, I wouldn't say, but I thought it was nice and I thought it was actually quite a good price for what it was. It is this long sleeve, navy blue and white striped. Is it a jumper? Is it a top? I can't, I don't know. The material is quite strange. It's got a high neck and it has these cute little panels in the side which just adds a little bit of interest really and what drew me to this was the nice stretchy material and that was £29 which you might think is a bit expensive but with student discount I got 10% off and that concludes my haul hope you enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you don't already and also check out my depop account because i've been trying to sell some old clothes on there so i'll put that in the box below and i'll see you guys with a new video soon bye